All right, guys, we're back with another card opening. Today we picked up a bunch of Crown Zenith mini tins. I don't know how long these have been out, but I purchased these on the Pokemon Center website for $11.99 Canadian each, which is basically $6 a pack. These each come with two packs in them and a, like a sticker set. So $6 a pack is not amazing, but for Crown Zenith, that's pretty much as cheap as you can get, seeing as you can't buy these packs on their own. So we decided to get one of each kind. There are five different ones here, and we're gonna crack them open and see what we can get. I haven't opened Crown Zenith in quite a while since we got that Elite Trainer box, so I'm excited to open some more. There's lots of cool cards in this set, so let's see what we can pull today. We are excited to announce that we are now partnered with Swift Lifestyles, which is a new gaming energy drink company. If you check out their website, they've got a few different flavors going on and lots more in the works. They sold out of their Christmas flavor. They got Cherry Burst, Blue Sour Strip, Green Apple. We got Bubble Gum. They even have a Hydrate Cotton Candy flavor and lots of other products for you to check out. I tried the Cherry Burst flavor. It's a nice alternative to something like G Fuel, which is pretty sweet as you guys know. This is kind of a, a more relaxed, not so in your face cherry flavor, and they don't have all the artificial colors. It's actually a nice clear color. So give this a try if you wanna switch it up. If you guys do place an order right now, they're giving away their free veggie pills. You can also use my code at the checkout. That is CZOR in all caps, S-C-I-Z-O-R. That's CZOR in all caps. That'll get you 15% off your order. Give it a try, make sure you use my code at the checkout. And now back to the video. All right, we're gonna start off with our hop box here with the Wooloo on the front. All right, so you get like a little collector card here and then they give you a couple stickers. But what we really want is these Crown Zenith packs. Hey, there's the code card for you guys. <clears throat> Honestly, I'm I'm really wanting to open some more of these because we got some cool pulls, even though they weren't worth that much. But um, yeah, there's also a what was it called? Collectors. There's some kind of like Zashian collectors thing coming out in May for Crown Zenith. I think that's the last release, so I'll probably pick that up as well. But that'll be the last of it after that. So we've got a Yan Mega in the first pack. <clears throat> There's your code. But yeah, I'm getting pretty excited for Scarlet and Violet coming out at the end of this month, so look forward to that. Let me know in the comments if you guys are looking forward to Scarlet and Violet, or if you think the base set's gonna be kind of a dud like it was for Sword and Shield. Um, we'll, we'll see how it goes. Uh, oh, we got a nice little Character card. I don't even know if it's a character card, but it's a nice little full art Absol. And our rare is a Rayquaza VMAX, so double hits in that pack. Nicely done. All right, on to the next mini tin. This one, I think this is Sonya and Yamper on the front of this one. I'm not too into the like characters in Sword and Shield, but I don't know. I guess it's a cool collector's item if you guys are into that. We just want to get these packs out of here. All right, code card for you guys. We've got a Grass Energy, Salazzle, Dusclops, Matang, Cherubi, Starly, Switch, Execute, Love Disc, Reverse Hollow Ryolu, and a regular double in that one. <clears throat> code card. Electric Energy, Matang, Digging Duo, Graveler, Oddish, Seal, Krikatot, Aeron, Ryolu. There we go, a nice little full art Krikatoon. That's a pretty cool card. And a regular Lycanroc, but we'll take that as a nice little hit. All right, third tin, we've got Bead with a little Hatena there. All right, there's our sticker and our little collector card. We got our two packs. There's your code. But yeah, honestly, I, I don't even know what these trainer gallery cards are worth in this set. You'll probably see it on the screen as I pull them, but they went crazy in Crown Zenith with this full art cards. Like 
even if they're not worth much, it's really cool to pull them. And I, I just love when sets do that. It makes it a lot more interesting than the original ones. And we get a signature Leon Hollow trainer card. I guess not bad. All right, we've come to our fourth tin. Wait a minute. This is Marini, I think, with her more Pico on the front. Honestly, I'm surprised I remember the names of these people. Like, I wasn't really paying much attention when I played through this game. And it has been a while. Code card for you. <clears throat> All right, Water Energy, Laron, Friends and Sinnoh, Gloom, Pokeball, Corfish, Oddish, Seal, Cricketot. Oh, there we go, a nice little full art Swablu. And our rare is a regular Rangaroo, but we'll take another one of those. <clears throat> I just realized, I think I left a pack from the other tin up there and didn't even open it. <laughs> before the other tin, so I don't even know which one is which. You guys will probably see on the video. But uh, honestly, these, these full art cards are awesome. Let me know in the comments what you think of these. I, I forget what set they started. The trainer gallery on i think it was like fusion strike maybe oh what is this elisa sparkle look at that was that in the right spot okay it was full art elisa sparkle trainer card we will take that all day code card for you all right psychic energy salazzle dusclops matang sunkern Bidoof, Coughing, Salandit, Purloin. Oh, Reverse Hollow Caesar. There we go. I don't think we pulled many Caesars on the channel. And regular Lycan Rock, but we'll take that. All right, just like that, we're on to our last tin. This is Leon with Charizard on the cover. I don't even know if you can pull a Charizard in this set, but we'll try our best. <clears throat> All right, we got our little card and our sticker. <clears throat> and we've got two packs to go. Honestly, some, some pretty good pulls today. I can't really complain. I, I don't know what any of these are worth at the moment, but you'll see it on the screen. Hopefully they're worth something, but either way, pretty cool. Um, even if we don't pull anything else, I would be pretty satisfied. Although, I would like to pull one more hit here. Execute. Love Disc. Zashian Reverse Hollow. Oh, what is that? The Pikachu, let's go. This is the amazing full art Pikachu card. It's not actually worth that much, but this card is beautiful. This might be like the coolest card I've ever pulled. Even though it's not worth an insane amount, this is amazing. I love this card. There is your code. Honestly, I won't be too disappointed because that we've been treated today with some nice pulls, so we cannot be mad at that, but Let's see what's in this final pack here. Crushing Hammer, Dusclops, Young Goose, Cherubi, Execute, Rockruff, Purloin, Reverse Hollow Emolga, and a regular Double. All right, guys, that's going to be it for today's opening. Let us know in the comments what you think of the pulls. Honestly, I think we got pretty lucky. We got 10 packs opened. We got seven hits here, including that awesome Pikachu and the Elisa Sparkle. I think those are worth a decent amount. The other ones might be like a couple bucks, but honestly, this set is really awesome. I would recommend this set to anyone. I'm looking forward to Scarlet and Violet. I hope that they can keep this momentum going. We'll see if they repeat the pattern of the base set being not too great. But if they keep this this hit rate up like there's a lot of hits in this set and i i think it's it's almost worth the extra money if you are going to buy them so what next time we open crown zenith we'll be back with that collector's edition that'll be sometime in may um for now you can expect some different card openings coming i got some stuff from costco coming up we got another mystery pack to open i'm going on a trip to the states so maybe i'll find something there but uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember to drop a like and subscribe if you're not and look forward to the next one. We'll see you guys next time.